music just feels so good. You're on the number one. Let's begin. All right. So this is the legendary Keith Shockley from Public Enemy and the Bomb Squad. And everything's backwards. It is. That's okay. I mean... They know, they know. I'll, I'll do a little, a quick, <laughs> a quick go around. I'll try to mirror the image because this place is amazing. Uh, Green screen walls. Yeah, so. it's a, uh, it's yeah. Even the ceiling, it's like, so it's like my, it's my. This is my Twitch world. Right, which is why I'm here today right. to. My tr my Twitch streaming world. And what time do you go live? Eight. I go tonight. I, on Tuesdays, I go live at nine. Yeah. Okay. And, and I, I go, I got to fix my thing. I had the wrong name. I, I go live, I go live at nine East Coast and I deal with the Pacific and six on the, on the Pacific. Specific or Pacific? Pacific. The Pacific. <laughs> so he doesn't stop until he feels like the vibe in the room ends, right? Yeah. You don't just go I, I usually nine do, to 11. I know. I, I, it's, it's usually three hours and, um, but if I get raided within like the last 15 minutes, I will kick it longer. Put in overtime. Yeah, I put in overtime. Nice. I'm waiting for my overtime emotes <laughs> to come up. I gotta wait for them to okay it. So I got some overtime emotes. So, cause everybody like to say, oh, it's going overtime. Overtime, overtime. So Twitch, Twitch has its own language. So like emotes are something I, I think you have to buy or it, you have to earn emotes are, are basically when you subscribe to somebody's chat but those are special emotes when you subscribe to somebody's stream so you have to pay to subscribe right to yeah each. yeah it's a subscription it's just like anything else like a, you subscribe to uh, um hbo max <laughs> it's not it's almost as expensive as hbo max right. for a month. <laughs> <laughs> but no but um um but there are Twitch emotes in there with their best basic emotes, so you can use that. But the cool thing is, you want the uh, the person you following their emotes, right. and that's cool because you can use their emotes in everybody else's chats and and stuff that's like that. Cool. Okay, cool. I have a lot to learn. So yeah. I mean, kind of, I mean, you have all this special equipment for going live on I, Twitch. It's like yeah. a special audio and video. It's like, a, oh my god, I, I have a lot of. I, I'm, I'm, so I come, you know, I come from the actual hard mobile DJ world, <laughs> so. With the records behind the me, records, right? You got the, I got the 45s and 7-inch, so Tuesdays I do 7-inch, it calls, it's called Time Capsule Tuesdays, and all of this 7-inch, a um, lot of stuff I play, and I, I, I treat it like a party, and then Saturday is disco, I call it the disco den, it's the reason why. Um, and then, and on Tuesdays, it's called Time Capsule Tuesday. I said that right. Time mm -hmm. Capsule Tuesdays, where I drink tequila and tell stories of us growing up, DJing since the seventies, and all up until now, and in the records and the production. And the and more you drink, the more you talk. The more, the more I slur. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and the more interesting stories. The more you interesting tell. coming. <laughs> the information spills. It, 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 it can get some kind of saucy, get kind of racy, kind of saucy with the stories. <laughs> right. So you must have like a whole vault of stories that everybody wants to hear. So every Tuesday, if you want to hear some of these personal stories in his life with you know, the people he's worked with yeah. and some of his, you know, I don't know, just like some special personal stories. And you got to follow him on Twitch. Yeah, you got to follow him on Twitch. Uh, then I, you know, do posts on Instagrams and stuff like that. Um, everything is under Keith Shockley for your Everything. Arm. All my Instagram, social Twitch, media, Twitch, Twitch, everything. Keith Shockley, type it in. And if there's another Keith Shockley out there, you owe me some money. <laughs> <laughs> Get those royalties. <laughs> All right, so you are spinning records. So spinning records and like vinyls. So, you know, I, I, I built this kind of, like, I don't have a, I have a green room, so it's not a green screen because I feel that um, having a green room gives me more of a 3D effect. You know, yeah, you don't disappear. You don't disappear into the like, mirror, like, like, like you don't see the back and everybody's got the cream. I, my stuff is kind of weird and then. You know, I got uh, special software to run all this stuff. 
Um, and I do a lot of stuff by myself. But like a lot of my guys that I DJ with, they got a team that works their stuff. And I work all my stuff myself. I think me and possibly, not possibly, me and um, Buck Rogers, who, who, by the way, my man DJ Buck Rogers, dope. Uh, check him out on Twitch and on follow him on Instagram. I plug my man because he kind of worked with me on building the visual aspect and what I wanted to do. And then I just took that knowledge from him and understanding from the lives, doing concerts and live stage stuff like that and doing sample concerts. I wanted to immerse myself with that. Sometimes it's a little bit of work, you know, switching the visuals, talking to the chat, playing, finding the next record. 45s, you got like three minutes. <laughs> and, and, and sometimes they're t two minutes and 50 seconds. You got to find the next record pretty fast. You can't loop. <laughs> it's like, let me hit the loop button. But I can do that if I go back into my system and set up a little loop machine inside my... I'm going to probably do that. So are you like pre-making your sets where you're, or are you just pulling records as I pull you go? records as I go, make sure some of them, and then the biggest thing is like some of my records skips. Like they, you know, 45s, I don't, some people, some cats got like, I'm not the only one doing 45s, like, you know, a bunch of cats and people doing 45s. I'd be like, my stuff be, I dig, and some of them be like crackly and ooh, this, oh, this one skips and I got to catch it and sometimes they might skip every section, I got to remember which one does and. I get, when I start the tequila kicks and I get into the moment, right. I forget what record skips. <laughs> I'm like, well, it's out. but it's kind of cool. I, people like it because it keeps it real. You know, it's like, okay, you know, I know guys that every record they play is perfect. I'm like, wow. Isn't you found that, that on 45? That's like a, having a not perfect set is what an audience appreciates. Yeah. Is that strange? Because you used to like, like strive to make sure everything's perfect so that like the audience isn't, I, I disappointed maybe. I get bored when it's perfect. You know, um, you know Z Trip. Uh, he was speaking about that, and was, I was going back and forth with him in the chat about, you know, some live stuff. Cause you know, one one thing about my I don't I got followers, but the thing about my chat is who pops in. So it'd be, <laughs> <laughs> it'd be some it'd be some real people that pop in just to see what I'm doing, hanging out. And you know, like to see, like it's great to see an OG legend like you still keeping it real in the game. Like, never left it. <laughs> well, it's funny. I spoke with another DJ earlier who said, you know, I can't believe you're, you're you're keeping up on Twitch and all this stuff. I'm too old for that. He said, and um, it's you, you're it's so overwhelming. You're doing most of it yourself, but I haven't even mm. dug into half of what you have to do to make a Twitch look even like partially professional and. You have the graphics, every the sound is good, like everything is moving and it's attractive and it's uh, like visually stimulating. And then there's other DJs like me who are starting out and we just have like nothing, it's just like us in a room. So like what would you say to somebody who wants to like upgrade and what what would you recommend that they buy in order to like get I mean, a better it, it's it's about your personality, what you can handle, you know. Um I still treat it like you're on TV, because you actually are. You know, some people is like, I'm just streaming. No, you're actually on TV. So, me personally, if you're not into, like, I'm into it. Like, this, trust me, doing this elaborate shit, is, it, it ain't cheap. <laughs> it ain't cheap. But basic stuff, I always tell people at least, um, like, you're getting into it. Like, you can go online and just buy little lights. Like, little, they, I, I got some. I got one, some, one of them around here. Little plastic light that gives it a little atmosphere. Um, because you, you still have to feel like, you know, if you're DJing, like, either a wedding or you're DJing at a bar or you like, you know, you have lights, you have atmosphere. Mm -hmm. Just, all that's done cheaply. You know, all you need is what? An eye rig, um, uh, a camera, and, and then mainly your laptop. I mean, I'm sophisticated because I, I go into heavy processing with these three, well, I got HD videos and all of that, like, that's... That cute, you can't run that on your just your laptop. So that's kind of... I think what I'm going to do, though, is do a whole separate video yeah. um, and show the YouTube audience um, exactly what you have going on in here that's so yeah. elaborate and sophisticated and the, some, what some of us are lacking. I, I'm, I'm, don't, don't worry about me. <laughs> this is a recording studio. At the same time, I DJ out here. Mm -hmm. So this is like... I, I, I And I got situations... Like, I got... 
I got it's, look at I got double fifteens. I got I got I got double too. fifteen speakers in hand with a horn pop from PV. Like nobody can have that in their crib. Like nobody even have that in their studio like that. I keep it like that because I treat it like a party, like I'm at a club. And I got all this stuff. I gotta use it. I, right. It sits in storage. So. I just figured out how to use it. Well, you know? nothing less. You don't have to get this high tech. No. But we're just going to impress you with what he's gone ahead and done. Um, because when when COVID happened and we're all sitting home doing, you know, we're waiting for events to happen, uh, he was one of the first ones to just get on Twitch and, and keep the party going. And, like, he jumped on that right away. And he, some of us are, like, at the back end of the train. We're just jumping on now because, like, events really haven't kicked off where we live yet. But... I think um, it's really exciting to, like you just said, you are on TV, so. Well, here's one thing. This is going to be incorporated into the real world now. So when people are performing now, because everybody's used to this, they're going to stream at the same time. So the people that can't come to your show, they're going to watch you streaming, and it's going to be a fee. You know, it's, right. it's, it's just a new way of doing things. You know, every venue right now, there are still venues they all they all setting the big venues to stream anyway because you're not going to have a lot of people there in the beginning. Mm -hmm. It's just what it is, um, and then they're going to be like, "Well, I'm 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 playing to an audience online that's 500 people," and you understand, this this people got thousand people, two thousand people in a room, I know. and that's like. That's 2,000 people. <laughs> that you're partying with. You're partying with, You're hosting man. that 2,000 yes. people party. They're yeah. there for you. It, exactly. So you can't look at that. You know, you can't, like, not sleep on it. It's like, oh, I'm too old for Twitch. You're never too old because it's a platform. Right. And if, if you're too old for Twitch, then you're too old to go to the bar. Yeah, so I guess we want to just tell people, like, if you're like me and you're kind of, like, hesitant of getting on there and getting in front of the camera and, like, showing off. Your personality and your skills on that level. <laughs> she has a lot of it. She just don't want. She just don't want. I'm in front of a camera. I know. She has he a lot of it. She's very animated. <laughs> She's been animated all day. <laughs> I know, but I feel like it's hard to do it in front of an audience. You know what I mean? So I just think that we need to just do it. Just do it. If you're hesitant about it, just jump in and do it. I had a DJ yeah. just jump in yesterday after like ten minutes notice, and she had the time of her life, and I'm hoping yeah. she does it again. So. It's, 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 it can be fun. It, it, it's, well, once again, you don't have to worry about bar fights. Yeah, yeah. safer, <laughs> definitely safer. It's safer. <laughs> so it's, um, I, I just, I just took it to the next level because I, instead of like, there's a lot of dope DJs on Twitch. A lot of them. And I didn't want to, I didn't want to be about just the, just the music. I wanted to be about the visual aspect. And so when you get into that aspect it, I can talk. I can talk about. All, I can take this into another frequency, <laughs> and, and into the, into the what the I'm gonna call it the, um, the NFT world, or the or the or the digital, uh, the digital platform world where where the NBA is, is messing around with this, not Twitch, but selling moments in time, visually in the digital space. Where you where you're using um, NFT non fungible uh, tokens where you're buying them with tokens, which is actual money. So you it's like lost me. It's I like, don't know what you're talking about it's anymore. Like, it's like well, it's <laughs> like it's like it's like <laughs> digital. Like the NBA has a platform. It's digital trading cards. Oh, you know, okay, it's, okay. It's digital. It's, it's digital trading cards like baseball cards. Mm -hmm. So what happens is you and artists is doing artists is doing real well. Not vocal artists, but visual artists. Mm. They're doing real well because they're selling their works digitally. Okay. In this in this platform, so that's where we at, and that's how music is going to move in into this, and it's moving in there kind of quickly. So, um, and I thought about that when I decided to do this whole room over. And give it a whole three D effect. Y'all ain't checking it out. Just check me out one night. I, I, some of my stuff is up, but you won't you won't hear some of the music because you know Twitch mutes and <laughs> <just> copyrights. <laughs> so, but you'll see the visual images and that I try to mess with and do and and give it a nice little vibe and a look and you know just to be different because you know um, everybody come to me to look for something. Keep what are you doing different? Oh, this is what I do different. Oh, wow. 
Well, I you think know. it's cool that you have all the visuals, but I think a lot of people are going to tune in for your stories. Oh, the stories. The stories. Because, like, where that. else are you going to be able to sit with Keith Shockley yeah. and get stories? And stories. You know, and you were just saying that and uh, with another person that you can't. You just get access yes. to people on these platforms yes. now, like Clubhouse, which I don't have yet, but yeah. Clubhouse is another place where everybody's just connecting. Oh, yeah, and, right now, the problem with Clubhouse is it's only for iPhones. You know, that's discrimination against us Android users, but I don't want to get into that. Hey. So, hey. We'll, we'll probably have our own app soon, <laughs> similar, you know, because that's always a bite. Uh, uh, Something that's it's, going it's, good. Nah, they'll, how business works, they're going to move over to the Android platform. It's like you start off with one, right. you cut a deal with I, Apple, and all of a sudden you just, with them, it blows up, and everybody's like, okay, we're going to bring the Android world in. Now, are you on Clubhouse, too? Yeah. Oh, okay. I so you're I had to be, because I, I did a um, couple of panels on Clubhouse. Oh. I get invited. And I, you know, you get it. I remember I woke up one morning. It was like my my birthday weekend, and I saw a friend of mine the day before say, you should get on Clubhouse. I was like, ah, I ain't getting on that. <laughs> so the next, within 24 hours, I wake up one morning, I grab, saw my phone, and I'm like, you've been invited to join Clubhouse. So I was like, man. I'm filling it out. Then I got tired because it was asking me a couple of questions. I was like, yeah, I'll do it later. Then the people that was in the room waiting for me to join started calling me because some of them knew me. Oh. <laughs> they called me and said, yo, we, made, we, we finished the finish filling it out. Because I guess the <laughs> people that, in, that designed the developer clubhouse, they kind of greeted me too. I mean, it's just, you get levels. Yep. <laughs> Who you are, you get levels. Right. <laughs> VIP treatment. So, you know, VIP <laughs> treatment. So they was waiting, and then they all showed me how it worked. And I was like, oh, this is cool. I was on there with, with a couple of people, a couple of real people on there. They are like, Keith, welcome to Clubhouse, and da, 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 da. you get to do this. You do your own thing. You can be there. So now when I go on, people will be, hey, come up to the stage. And I'm like, I don't feel like it. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what that means to come up to stage in the clubhouse. So, I mean, you get to go like a. Well, it's, it's you, you like if you design a room, talk about Twitch. So that's your room. So you you're the stage, and then people come into your oh. room and they're in the audience. Oh, so what happens is cool. yes, yeah, it's, it's cool. It's kind of cool, huh. you know. But it's got to have something to talk about. But then they have a thing when you're in the audience. There's a hand. So if you want to speak. You hit the hand button, course, yeah. and we bring you up to the stage, and then you talk, and then you say what you have to say, or you want to ask a question, then they bring you back down. That's, that's that kind of thing. Okay. Yeah, it's and hard it, to visualize unless you have it, yeah. I guess, because well, you only hear about it yeah. if you don't have the app. Well, yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of, but it's just like, it's like doing a panel, like you do, you know, when you do the conventions. Yeah. Same thing, you got, you on the stage, and there's an audience. Mm -hmm. You got questions, raise your hand, but right. it's just all virtual. It's all virtual on on the thing. I guess this, so. We're all headed. Everything is going to be virtual. So get on Clubhouse if you have the iPhone and follow yeah. him on there and um, follow me everywhere. Clubhouse. Everything is Keith Shockley. Right. It's yeah. so Tuesdays. What if they tune into you? What are you playing on Tuesdays? What kind of? Um, I don't like when I do forty fives. It's all over the place. It's like I don't play set music. Like you're going to hear all reggae nights. But I do have guys that play 45s, where they always do reggae. You know, mm. they always they'll have a reggae night of 45s. I I kind of play music that I grew up with, or I thought was funky and disco and hot and underground and pop and um, whatever I find that I feel in that moment. Do you have just open format, uh, a little bit of everything? It's very, yes, whatever it's you all, feel like. All my formats are open. Yeah. <laughs> do you take requests from people in the? No. <laughs> I don't do requests. I already I might. It, I, I might. Just had to ask. I know. I <laughs> might, but I don't do requests. You come. You come to my channel. You come to hear what Keith Shockley's into. Like I go to other people's channel. I come to hear what they're into. Like I hang out on Homegirl Bella Fiasco's chat. Uh, chat. I hang out on everybody's chat. I, it's funny. And the funny part is when I go in people's chat and they realize that who I am. They're like, Oh my God! What are you doing in here? <laughs> Listening to you guys. I. I I follow so many. My watch goes off like right now. That's so everybody's right now. Off when it's you going go on. Up. People, I, I get messages when everybody <laughs> streams. Everybody that goes online and streams, I get messages all the time. And you put them up on the big TV. So when Keith is yeah. in your chat room, he's literally watching you from his studio yeah. on a big ass, a big TV. <laughs> yeah. And so make sure uh, you know. Yeah, you make sure you come in. You come in, say hi, what's up, and. I'll, hey, I, I saw you on so and so and whatever, man. I, and he's a real person, so you can have real conversations yeah. with him. And 
he gets real passionate about my next thing. My next thing is to reach into the chat. My next visual to reach into the chat and grab somebody and pull them out in real life. Hey, I grabbed them. Here they are. <laughs> I mean, Freddy Krueger stuff. Freddy. <laughs> but. Hey, I'm into that. I'm into that. But there's a lot of cool people doing a lot of cool things. You know what else does about these these kids called the Boom Pack Boom Bat Kids? They in um um Oakland and oh was it Oakland or San Francisco? Look them up. One of them. They in Oakland or San Francisco. But it's like the, I think like the, the Bay Area. Um, they use puppets. <laughs> Yo, that's it's, it's like watching hip hop Sesame Streets. It's like, it's crazy. They rhyming, the puppets are rhyming, they're DJing, they're bringing in guest DJs. They got the craziest show. If they don't get picked up by a major, like 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 a Netflix or want to do something weird with them or somebody like that, they, they lose it. They missing it. Well, I just want to say real quick on that note, because this, is, this interview is on Triple Threat FM Radio, and uh, some of our DJs have become celebrity puppets on TikTok. <laughs> so I think it's just called Celebrity Puppets, but DJ Echo is a... Celebrity puppet now, and um, so I gotta Hugo. go. In there. I gotta go in there. Well, you have to, yeah. I, I gotta go in. I, I like and this TikTok has a lot of dancing. I don't do dancing. No, I do two no. steps. No, it has, it has. I know it has a lot of stuff. <laughs> it's such a great. I love TikTok. Um, you should be on there. You'd be a celebrity. I am puppet on there. No, I, I am on there, but I don't really do that much posting. You know, um, it's like it's a lot of work to do that. You need a team. It, it, that, that's why after. I, when I do a show here, I am exact. I'm kind of exhausted. Well, what were you walking? I walked in. And he was making some kind. It sounded like a, a drop for his. I'm doing uh, my drop like of my show. <laughs> for, but it was all like it sounded like a nursery rhyme playing in the background, and he was talking like. Yeah. yeah what was that? Was that a that church was, intro or something? No, that's for no. I was making that for 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 the post on Instagram. I'm kind of wow. late with my post, but yeah, I'll so, put it up. It's I don't funny. know. It sounded cool though. It sounded so cool. I'm, we asked yeah. him to make us a triple threat drop. Yeah. Um, I had to ask you to make me a Stardust drop. A Stardust? Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, you want me to do that now? Like, I, like, I can do that with a... I don't know how this audio is going to come out, but no, I can no, do no, that. No, 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 no. But I, I, I mean, do I'm just going to That would be awesome. All yeah, right, so we're going to get some that. Keith Shockley drops. Here's the Keith Shockley drops. <laughs> get some explosions. Or yeah. Bam, bam, bam. Whatever you're going to do, we're excited about I don't it. know. Whatever. So. Let's just do a lot of things. But, uh, yeah, so this is the... Home of, you know, she could have showed you my plaques, but y'all need. To oh see my! Them. I'm showing them everything. <laughs> I, I want to cut the audio here for the um for the, the station tour. interview, but we have a YouTube. This is going on YouTube, so all the cool stuff. I'm not gonna leave anything out if, unless he stops me. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna take you around the whole room and the plaques and the mag, every the books, magazine, everything. This is a small museum. It is incredible here. Um, it's a small museum. It's a little, you know. I so I get know. to show them everything. You get, you get to show them everything. Cool. You get to show them everything. And I will save a little bit for when you're live at yeah, nine. Nine right? and nine. And I'll. But you're only gonna see is the green room. So. So what we'll do is we'll show the green room first, yeah. and then we'll I'll You'll go film, on. Go yes. on in and film it. I'll put on. How to add yeah, it all in show, together yeah. so you get a full. You get a full. Effect. But also, don't let just don't wait here. Just go and follow him tonight on Twitch, so you can just watch yeah. it live. Yeah. And then um, if tonight's not convenient, there's also Sunday. It's Saturday. Sa well, which is which Saturday. is. So I go on at eleven East Coast time, because I got I got a, more followers on the West Coast, okay. so I got to give them time to come in. Right. But the East Coast, I figure they're hanging out, they're up, they Saturday hang night. out. It's like Saturday night, catering and, to both coasts. Yeah. So I, I guess that's why. I think one time I, I'm gonna have to do an afternoon one because I got people from oh, uh, from Europe following me. Oh. In Australia, they come through, and I gotta like do. I want to catch them at a time where they feel good. Right. You know, I gotta figure out what that Considered is. Considered all all time zones, <laughs> worldwide. Yeah. All right, so he's gonna be hooking you guys up with everything on Twitch uh, Tuesdays and Saturday, Saturday Tuesdays, into yes. Sunday nights. Yeah. Tuesdays and, and Saturday um, nights. Sunday yeah. Nights. All right, so we're gonna stop here. Yeah. I know there's so much more we could talk about, but I'm gonna just give them a tour of the room, and then we'll go live again later. So. Yeah. Thank you so much for your. Time Thank you. Thank stuff. you. Woo!